Yo, what's up gamers? It's Mario here, and I'm lucky to have uh, a hidden debate between Jadar and Michael Lofton that got buried. But I have it, and I have a video of it, and I'm going to show it for you guys. It's an incredible debate, completely riveting. You guys will enjoy. You're watching Reason and Theology Live, and I'm your host, Michael Charitable, Rage of the Centers Lofton. And I will be debating the schismatic, heretic, and guy who needs to repent, Jay Dye. You're turning into uh, Jason Alysis. I'll be debating Michael Lofton. And I just wanted to say that Michael Lofton does not understand a transcendental argument and is a proponent of natural theology, which is cringe and totally not based. And also, um, he doesn't have the noose and is in prelus. Now that is just uncharitable and imprudential and not hyperqualified of you. You made no distinctions and have no nuance. That is completely schismatic and utterly damaging for the soul. You are guilty of evil suspicion and you are not looking into my heart. Can you read my heart? You schismatic orthodox, them be always hating on me and I hate that. Get real. You're watching Jay Dyer with Jay's analysis, and actually I wanted to point out that you have papal clown masses and that you have uh, schismatic mass. You know what I mean? Like your mass is totally Now what you're cringe. saying is just completely real. imprudential and is completely schismatic and not hyperqualified. Now let me explain. Now, if there was a clown mass, there was a prudential reason for why Pope Francis would have done it. He would have done it to stop the red trad schismatics from schisming from the magisterium. And that is why that's just cope showing that you don't have the news and that you're in prelist and that you don't understand the transcendental argument uh, tag, as we call it, when we own the atheist epic style Fortnite Among Us Chungus 3000. And uh, you are a modernist hippie who doesn't understand because you're a goober, basic uh, philosophy and basic metaphysics and basic transcendental metaphysics. Now that is just uncharitable. That is just uncharitable. Nature. That is just not nuanced and not hyperqualified and I call you to repent for what you said to Trent Horn. Oh, I need to repent. Because that was uncharitable oh, okay. and that was not hyperqualified oh, and that was okay. not nuanced and uh, it didn't have the magisterium and it was the worst. No news. Bang, you know no news, bro. You don't got the news. Clown mass. Clown mass. You got a clown mass, dude. Got now that is not hyperqualified. That is schismatic in nature. Yeah, debate me in voice chat. The debate me in voice chat, okay? And Pope you're Francis. Hater. You're a hater, dude. Jay, Jay, I've been charitable to you. I've given you all this time to talk. And now I'm going to make my closing arguments. You are schismatic in nature and you are not charitable and you need to repent. I'd just like to close by saying that uh, Michael, no matter how many times we explain it, does not understand a transcendental argument. And uh, he doesn't have a basic understanding of philosophy, metaphysics, or uh, the ecumenical councils, or how we're conciliar and all that. So, yeah.